Art McCarran, Chairperson, St Mary's Convict GA. It's been a crazy and challenging year, not just for our club, but every club in the country. But thankfully, my first year as chair, we now have a junior championship final to look forward to. Challenging, obviously, from the COVID-19 pandemic, but we all know the challenges that has brought since March, but also for club like ours in financial terms. However, we are very fortunate that we have a hard working committee that goes door to door selling national club draw tickets from Christmas time to February, rain, hail or snow. Over the past three years for a small club like ours, we have sold our full allocation of tickets with this year being 2,500 tickets. This is a great boost at the start of the year, but in particular this year, since we don't have any income since March. We pride ourselves on having one of the best playing facilities in the county and also the luxury of state-of-the-art floodlights, which any GAA club will be proud of. The club has a good underage structure in place with fantastic coaches giving up their time from under six to minor level. And it's also great to see some of the senior men and senior ladies team coaching at levels in the club. Our senior ladies have just finished a successful season under the new manager Mick Calvey and have won the intermediate plate final. But now it's time to turn to their senior men to finish the season on high. We thank all our community and all our sponsors who have sponsored the men's team and all our teams in the club. Take for example this year we have five new sponsors of kits for underage teams. We really appreciate them for coming on board. On behalf of myself, the hard working committee and the community, we wish Lawrence, Connor, Paul and the senior team all the best in Sunday's final. We want them to enjoy it, save the occasion and be responsible. The last time our guys were in the final was 2005 with some of the young team that day still playing the likes of Lawrence, Packy Mealy and Liam Mealy with Connor and Paul Lynch also playing that year. Hats off to Lawrence and his backroom team over the last few years have taken our club team from Division 4 to Division 2 and now we've reached a championship final. So please God, everything was right for them on Sunday. Best of luck guys.